Good morning, guys. Today is a huge day. We're here in Tamcock. We are going to Hanoi today. That means the end of this motorcycle journey all the way from Ho Chi Minh City. Very exciting, but sure it'll be a bit sad to see the end and uh, then go try and sell these motorcycles. We got about a 100 kilometer ride today. It's the last day. It's a sad day. It's the last day. Last day. Ben, it's the last day. Mm. I don't even know what to say. It hasn't really hit me yet that we're almost done. I'm kind of excited. It's not gonna be the nicest ride today, going back into the city. It's gonna be kind of crappy after all the nice rides we've had through the mountains. Uh, it's just gonna be a lot of traffic. Hopefully we can sell the bikes quick and uh, get to Halong Bay. All right guys, this is very exciting. We have traveled three weeks across a country for this, over 2,000 kilometers on our motorcycles, and we are finally here. The Hanoi McDonald's. Woo! <laughs> We've been looking forward to this day for three weeks. All we wanted was McDonald's. We traveled across the country and it's closed. Uh, ah! uh, Grand opening is December 2nd, no. So this hard. hurts so much. I guess we'll have to go to a com competitor. Going to the knockoff McDonald's, Lotteria. Gonna get the big star, the knockoff Big Mac. Isn't it a beautiful thing? 79,000 dong for this uh, big star combo. That's the equivalent to $5.60. Oh, bad boy. Do you like Christmas bird? Oh, it's bigger than a Big Mac. It's heavier. Well, I enjoy this meal. You guys enjoy this little montage of us driving three weeks across the country of Vietnam. Yeah, We're here in Ho Chi Minh City, Vietnam. Today, we leave the we leave this beautiful city <laughs> and back to having fun. Look at this view. That was terrible. Vin Pearl, baby. Oh! Stopped here at a viewpoint of one of the nicest beaches in all of Vietnam. Look at that. Unreal. Oh, you gotta pound it out. Yeah, you no, no, the small one. one. That small one. <laughs> Made it here to Dragon Bridge. How cool is this thing? Oh, oh you got it! Oh, <laughs> We're about to get our first experience of a Vietnam hospital. Oh. Couple feet in, pretty neat, pretty neat. Definitely made for short people, got a kink on my neck a bit here. Kank just discovered that Drake literally has zero oil on his bike. <laughs> yeah! Well, you guys enjoyed that. I just enjoyed my burger. That was fantastic. Fries were good. Burger's good. Meat was a bit funky, but still good. I also ordered another chicken burger here. What's going on right now? He's taking Did you just shoe. steal your shoe? He's fixing it. He just grabbed it off my feet. You legit gonna get my... Uh-oh, Ben. Uh-oh. This city is pretty hectic so far. 
When we first arrived, we could not find a parking spot anywhere. We ended up having to pay 40,000 dong, which is over $2 for a parking spot. And as I'm talking, this guy's still working on Ben's shoes. He's gonna ask for money and it's gonna be sad because Ben's not gonna give him any money. But he literally just grabbed Ben's shoe and ripped it off its foot and started working on it, so it's his problem. You got KFC, you got Domino's, you got Dunkin' Donuts, you got Burger King. I know he's got all your tourist needs covered. Oh, yeah, I want to be Selling your motorbikes here is uh, stressing us out a little bit. Thinking it might be pretty difficult to sell them. Um, worst case scenario, we have to sell them to a bike shop, but they're not gonna give us very much for them. We have some ads up on some Facebook pages. No hits, no hits yet. So we were just walking down the street and found a couple of people that wanted to look at our bikes. So uh, one guy's taking mine for a test drive right now. This girl's looking at Ben's. All right, sorry this video has been a bit of a mess. So Drake sold his bike for 1.5 million dong, 107 Canadian dollars. So he took a loss of about $100. He bought it for 200. He's the only one to sell his bike so far. I just drove drove around for quite a while just asking people if they're interested. I think the strategy for sure though is just to go around and talk to people and try to find someone to buy the bike. Bike shops are only offering me $100 and I paid $300 for mine so I really hope I can get more than that. Now we just have to find Travis. Those are his shoes. What are you doing? Trav's getting his first tattoo. <laughs> All done? Oh yeah, it looks sick. What a way to end today's video. Trav gets a tattoo. We finished the big road trip today. All right guys, we'll see you tomorrow as we try to sell our motorcycles. Hope to God we do tomorrow.